episode of Coach's Show. I'm your host, Jordan Myers, here in studio with head coach Dave Chayak. Thank you for coming today. Thanks, Jordan. Thanks for having me. Just to start off, like, how was your summer in the offseason? What did you get to do? Well, like everybody else, I think it was a, it was a little short because of the weather and whatnot, but uh, myself and my family certainly enjoyed it. We did some traveling to South America and went up to, to Canada as well and uh, uh, spent a lot of time with family and friends, and uh, it was enjoyable. And it was a time to kind of press the restart button and uh, get back into our season here. What did you guys get to do in South America? Well, we, my, my, my wife's from there, so we got a chance to enjoy some, some warm weather and see the sun a little bit and uh, did a lot of swimming and did some hiking and uh, played on the beaches. And uh, all in all, again, it was just a, an enjoyable experience just to settle down and relax and spend time with the family. And then did you also do any scouting during the off-season for the upcoming season or...? Yeah, no, we, we uh, myself and uh, our, my assistants, uh, Coach Blair and Coach Jindra, they went out to Alberta in the Midwest, and we continue to do some recruiting in, in the summertime, and not as much as we do during the season, but we got a chance to identify some young kids, and uh, now we're just kind of still evaluating and, and monitoring, and uh, we picked up a couple kids last week. So uh, to answer your question, yeah, we did a little bit of recruiting, uh, basically to identify some young, some young talent. Welcome back to the Coaches Show. I'm your host, Jordan Myers, here in studio with Coach Shayek. So also going off for the rest of this weekend, you know, going into the Kendall Classic, do you have any lines already set in mind or is it still kind of up in the air since we have? Yeah, I think the, the lineup we had against Regina there last weekend, uh, those lines, I think, for the most part, we'll, we'll keep together. We're still tweaking a, a couple of the lines, I should say. And uh, our D pairings are starting to get together. Uh, I think some of the younger guys are, are making it difficult for the staff to make choices right now, which is a good thing. I think we got good, solid competition and guys pushing for spots. But I think for the most part, uh, again, we'll keep the lines together as they were. And the D pairings will be very, very similar unless something changes or, or there's some injuries this week. And talk about injuries. Is there any injury updates as of now, or anyone off the line because of injuries? Yeah, the only one right now that's experienced a little bit longer-term injury is Andrew Pickering. He, I think it was on the first or second day of uh, captain's practice. He had a he was, he was bonked on the ice there, and uh, he's got a concussion. So he just started to skate yesterday. He's symptom-free, and I, I just think it's going to be a longer process with him. And then, uh, other than that, I think we're relatively healthy right now. All right, and then also Kamal and Gunderson obviously being back and being our big guys in net. Do you know who's going to start yet, or are you going to split it just like you did for the Regina game? We're still working our way through that process. Obviously, that's that's a key position for us mm -hmm. in order to have success this year. The positive is uh, both those guys are juniors now. They've, they've got uh, great experience in the league. They've and David from Anchorage asks, who is your least favorite NHL player? Least favorite? Least favorite. My least favorite? That would be a first question. <laughs> uh, probably a guy like Sean Avery, who's a pest guy that uh, does a lot of talking and uh, doesn't represent the NHL the way it should be, in my opinion. All right, today, Coach, and just for everyone out there, the Sullivan Arena, Friday and Saturday night, come out and support your Seawolves. And that's it for tonight. I'm your host, Jordan Myers.